So we got a couple different line choices here. It looks like you can kind of go cut on the inside through these rocks or we can take a wide outside line, carry a bit more speed through the rock section coming up. Um, but definitely a lot of options here to choose from. I think we're gonna try them all, see which one feels the best and then decide. Uh, the course is looking really fun. Apparently nothing much has changed from last year, but you know, we've got two massive climbs in, so you want a really light bike set up, but then we have some big, awkward rock features, uh, which kind of spice things up a little bit. So you want a capable bike, but a light bike. So it's a really hard balance for riders to, to swing or choose which way. Just checking it out for the first time. You know, you're kind of looking at the two left line inside, what, what uses more energy, and I don't know. First impressions, maybe the left line, but we'll see how it goes. Technic head coach says the uh, left one, so we're gonna try the left one. Yeah, 
Santa, si yo recuerdo. Era malísimo. ¿eh? Ah, sí. Yeah, that awkward little corner, I mean, it's, I think it's new, it wasn't in last, last year's show, it's a bit different to what it's normally is, but yeah, it's caught a few people out, I almost crashed it on the, both times I've done it, so it's pretty loose, and you come in at so much speed that you're on the brakes quite a lot to slow down, so I think you need to almost brake a little bit before the corner and then ease off the brakes on the corner, because if you brake on the corner on that route, your wheels just go.